Then Abigail made haste. I just read it for you in Luke chapter 13, but I'd have us go back there. Luke 13 and verse 24. Because this is a synonym that our Lord used to describe those that are entering in. How does it describe them? Well, in, in Luke 13 and verse 24, he says, strive to enter in at the straight gate. That word strive in the original, if you looked it up, it's the word to agonize. In other words, there is an effort that is put forth here, just like we're seeing of Abigail, to get to David. There's, there is that, that alarm, that drive, that pushes us to Christ. Now, I've heard messages where preachers try to work this up in people. That's not what it's talking about. The Lord is identifying or characterizing those that do enter in. They enter in agonizing. How many times have you seen a runner? I, I know some runners, they just, they don't get their high until they've done their 10 miles a day, you know. And I'm like, oh. But there's something that motivates them and drives them. But it's in them. It's, it's a gift. I've got a friend that tells me that. I said, Ken, you've never experienced a high until you're about your 10th or 11th mile in. And I said, well, and I'll never experience it. I'll be dead. But it's an example of how unless the Lord gives you that desire, you never desire it. You might go out there and walk a few paces and say, okay, I'm tired. i go back. Now, this striving then is, is a gift of the Spirit. It's a sign of life. It's an evidence 